Hello, Internet. My name's Dark Arts, and today we are playing for you, Crazy Hand. This is a strange game, and I really like it. It is inspired by, well, at least I think it's inspired by, it, it, it closely resembles, uh, Triacnid. If you remember Triacnid, you were three-legged spider, kind of crawling around, trying to find your loved one, collecting little maggot babies, and all in all, a really terrific game. Uh, but this one... Crazy Hand kind of takes that and elevates it a little bit, and it, it does so in a really nice way, and I would love to show you. So you play as whatever this thing is, and <laughs> I really don't know what it is. And you have to get to the end of the level uh, within a certain amount of time. Well, no, you have to get to the end of the level. Uh, within a certain amount of time is a score-based thing, as you can see at the top corner here. You have a certain amount of energy. I'm not quite sure what happens when the energy gets to the bottom. Uh, I never... don't think I have yet. Uh, oh, dear lord, my arm's freaking out. There we go. Uh, all in all, pretty resembling Triacnid, but, you know, not quite. Because in this game, you, of course, have a score. Well, you know, you have the max scores, I guess. Uh, you have a score, the terrain actually makes a difference. Look, the terrain actually gives and folds with you. Uh, I think if I grab onto one of these rocks... Yeah, if I grab onto one of these rocks, it limits my hand, so I can't actually grab onto anything, and if you, all three of them, you kind of just grab onto stuff, you kind of just fall over. It's really interesting. I really like it. And it gets a hell of a lot different. Oh, yeah, that's the end of the level. Whee! So, the game is pretty damn beautiful looking. I really, oh shit. I really like how this looks. Oh shit, come on, grab on, grab a hold. Not to that though, because, you know, hazards and blowing up your hand and stuff. Oh shit, grab down a, a skull. Why are there skulls? Mystery of the game. Shit. Two of my hands grabbed onto the skulls. I don't know why. Uh, grab onto an arm poking out of. Yeah, again, I don't know why there's so much dead stuff. And then the, those little things right there is it's based on score. The actual, well, not score. It uh, upgrades stuff. Oh, Stupid arm. Oh. Come on. Let go of every, everything. Come on. Dragon bodies! Grab onto the disembodied foot and advertising sign. Uh. Move! Move. Let, let go of me, foot. Another difference that this has from Triacnid is an upgrade system. This is. Well, an upgrade system. You spend those little white points that you get on certain things, helping you, and then when you upgrade, you can actually go back in levels and get a better score. Kind of diversity and stuff. Wait, is diversity a game? Oh, fuck. That sounds so familiar. It's kind of fucking first today, I just know it. Uh, anyway, let's upgrade a couple things. I would love... what is this thing? Reduce energy consumption. That helps with score, so we'll take that. I can't get any of the other stuff, because it's glowing green, and I only have 32 points. This is 30 points right here. Increase line. Mm -hmm. Yawning. Excuse me. Hmm. Increase range. Increase protection. Explosion. Let's go with this line thing. And then... If you don't like this, I it, uh, apparently you can take it back for a little bit less. Down some pipes. Ow. Oh, my arm's caught. Fuck. Get off. Get. Shit. The game uh, has a couple problems. Uh, the arms are a bit, you know, loose with the physics, and uh, <laughs> uh, it, it, it makes it look pretty weird. But it's not game breaking. So path, 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 path. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch a tiger by the toe. 
you're pretty stupid if you do that, so I'm going to go this way. Down here, well that way is deadly. So we'll go this way. We uh oh, shit. Or not. Nope. Fuck. Okay, you don't have to explode all the time, you know, just... Alright, let's restart. A little, bit, a little bit closer here. Come on, stop floating around. Let me press you. Go back down the tubes. Like that earthworm gym level. Fuck, grab onto something! <laughs> that was fun. Alright. Well, that way, because that other way is, you know, like another dead end. That way. Come on, come on. Grab onto something. Grab onto something. Uh, so yeah, I think I'll go this way. Oh, no, get... Shit. Come on. There we go. Floaty hand crampy things. I made it! Yay! Score! Oh, 75%. I think 100% you get both stars. Shoot for that for you if you want. I'm good with what I got. Oof, oof, oof. Ow. Ooh, a catapult. Fun. Let's play with the catapult. Whee! I'm flying over a, a pit of something. Man, there's a whole bunch of shit here that I, I don't want to hold on to. Oh, fuck. Damn it, I'm attached to an arm. Oh, fuck. That was the end of the level. Oh, and it branches off into another path. Ooh, nice. So yeah, this is the map level thing. Lots of levels. Divulging paths. This thing. This is a fun game. This has been Crazy Hand. I pointed with the, the fuck. I pointed to the screen like you would see. <laughs> the link to it will be in the description below. My name is Dark Arts, and Crazy Hands. Ooh, like jazz hands only misshapen. Like that one episode in Seinfeld where the guy were... Oh, fuck. Name. Name. It was Jerry, Elaine, Kramer. What was the fourth guy? Fuck. I call myself a television know-it-all. Fuck that! <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, crazy hand.